The weather is also battering Whatcom County with more snow last night and there's now freezing rain on the way. It's been a rough few months for people living up there. King 5's Eric Wilkinson is live in Bellingham tonight with how they're weathering the multiple storms. Eric. And that's right. Heavy rain coming down right now, as you mentioned, turning to freezing rain later tonight. You know, we all like the snow for the first few days, but it's when it turns into a few weeks that it starts to get old, especially for those who are out in it all day, every day. Yeah, I wouldn't mind if the snow would stop. Groundhog Day is still a month away, but it feels like it's already here in Whatcom County. It sure is, and then we start all back over again. Tim Morris has been plowing roads here for 24 years. He says this winter has been one of the worst. He and his crew at Bellingham Public Works have been working 12-hour shifts for two solid weeks as the snows come over and over and over again. It all started on Christmas Eve when Tim worked 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. You know, just fit in Christmas when you can. You know, I think there's a lot of coffee. I think there's a lot of Red Bull. Somebody was joking like we should get some stock and energy drinks. In other parts of Whatcom County, the miserable weather has been dragging on for almost two months, starting with historic floods that still have hundreds of people out of their homes in Sumas and Everson. How sick of this are you right now? Right now, I'm, I'm pretty sick of it. <laughs> But that's what I do for a living. Along with those plow drivers, postal workers aren't getting a break. Holiday deliveries combined with weeks of white across Wacom have patience and even clothes wearing short. Well, I mean, it's hectic. There's no doubt about that. Trying to fight up and down hills and deep snow and people are typically dressed for the weather. You've got your snow shorts on. Yeah, um, I figure if I'm cold, I'll work faster. So. That's the way to do it. <laughs> right now, the race is on to get the streets plowed once again before tonight's freezing rain sets in and turns the streets to slopes as Tim and the crew look for sunnier days ahead. Hopefully it warms up here and all the snow disappears. When we were at Public Works today, we heard uh, a receptionist talking to some angry members of the public, wondering why their roads hadn't been plowed yet. You have to remember, every time it snows, those drivers has to have to come out on these main arterials again, hit all those, then hit the secondary roads again, and then try to make it to your street. Please be patient. Live in Bellingham tonight, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.